example, a lot of the people we spoke to today support this plan to kill this local tax. The ordinance will basically mean anybody who owns a car here in Ording will get $20 off per vehicle. That's how much they'll save. But that project could also make some plans to maintain streets, leave them idling. And we don't drive much. But Ording resident Terrence Gore says that doesn't matter. His costs keep rising. We've been here, uh, what, 17 years? And everything just keeps going up and the car tabs hurt. But that's about to change. This city of less than 10,000 is about to pump the brakes on the cost of car tabs. The city council passed unanimously a, an ordinance that reduced the transportation benefits district fees from $20 per car to $0 per car. Ording Mayor Joshua Penner says that is going to mean driver's tabs will cost $20 less per car. It's really important to signal to voters that we heard their vote in response to Initiative 976. The mayor says the city collects about $140,000 a year in Transportation Benefits District, or TBD taxes, money that goes toward resurfacing and other maintenance projects. So what happens to those roads that need to be resurfaced if you're no longer taking in that tax? That's a good question. Uh, we have about $250,000 in TBD money banked right now, and we had projects that we'd planned to use it for this year, we are not going to use it for those projects. We're using it for emergent projects right now. Like potholes and other maintenance issues. And we need that. The roads are terrible. Not everyone we spoke to thought it was a good trade-off. We would pay. We would pay more so that everyone, it would be equal. But most of them did. They actually want to reduce the tax, huh? Yeah. That's pretty good. It works for me, yeah. Get, okay. the, get the cost down. I'm excited about it. Well, I think that's great. The mayor's... The mayor says there's another upside to eliminating the local tax. It means the city will not have to send out refunds should the Supreme Court uphold I-976. Live in Ording, Kristen Ayers, King 5 News.